there, dear. How have you been feeling? Okay. Okay. And watching your vitals since you dosed off for a little bit, but it is time for your checkup. Um, welcome to the clinic. I know you had a bit of a tumble, but I'm glad you're here now and you're safe. I am the night nurse. My name is Nurse Dreams, as I tend to make people fall asleep. Based off of your sheet here, I'm going to be performing a couple simple, just very basic examinations on you. I'm going to be looking and treating those wounds, taking your heart rate, asking you how you've been, cleansing the areas that I need to move you around a bit. You know, everything. Before we begin, can we double check your name? What's your name, dear? Okay. Perfect. And what is your uh, address of residence? Okay. Give me a second. Okay. And is your pharmacy the same as last time? So, enough with the questions. First, I'm going to be looking into your eyes as you had a bit of an impact on your head. And I'm going to ask you a couple simple questions. Just look at me dead on, okay? I'm just going to be looking into your eyes and I have a bit of a flashlight here that I'm going to shine. Just keep looking at me, okay? Good, thank you. So, just going to cover that side. Just quick. Okay. That one didn't seem to dilate too much, but that's also where the impact is. Okay. The other side now. It's going to cover this eye. silly it sounds, but follow through with me. We're going to play a game called How Many Fingers Am I Holding Up? So, how many fingers is that? Two. How many fingers is that? you hooked up, but I always double check because sometimes the machine can't get what I can, so it's going to be a bit cold. I apologize. I'm going to place this on your chest, so please pardon my reach, but I'm just going to place that on your chest now. What I want you to do is take a couple deep breaths, okay? Just in and out. Okay. 
hand to the other side really quick Just in and out Okay Now I'm going to test it onto your neck So just really quick In and out Okay, that was good That was also analyzed onto my computer Next, I'm just quickly going to be looking inside your mouth. I'm gonna pull the light back here. You impacted your head from a fall, and your jaw seems to be a little bit injured as well. So, I'm gonna take a look inside with a bit of a tongue depressor. So, please open your mouth really quick, dear. Thank you. It's going to shine. Just a bit of uh, swelling as you were injured, but that's normal, okay? Good. What we're going to be looking at next is... I have this fancy, <laughs> kind of old school thermometer, but... May I please place this under your tongue to test your temperature? Sometimes with impact the antibodies to work a little bit harder. So, just kidding. Okay, let's see here. 96.9. That's good. Very normal. around your face, okay? Yeah. I'm gonna get another pair of gloves on for this as to not disturb your wound. We will treat that after I look around your face. Um, I'm going to ask you to move your face around a bit as to assess your nerves. So, first I'm just going to place it around your face here. Just a bit close. And now, can you just clench your jaw? Okay. Okay. And clench your jaw. Okay. Now going to press around the eye area. just appears to be a bit swelling, that's why. And does any of this hurt at all, or are you okay? Nope. You seem to be slowly falling asleep, and that's okay. Um, if at any point this feels uncomfortable, please let me know. It will help me better take care of you, okay? Now I'm going to get into an area that might hurt a bit As you were injured right at the top, I'm going to just take care of that area So, looking at the wound area, I'm going to press around Let me know if it feels extremely uncomfortable Or if you feel something that doesn't feel right, okay? So, I'm just going to press 
this around the area. It's a pretty bad wound, but that's okay. It will be taken care of. Okay. A full assessment of that would probably be So have a couple wounds on your cheek. I'm just going to press around that area. So no pain. Okay. So just okay. I'm going to write what I just saw down. We're going to do a deep cleansing of that area. It appears to be getting a bit swollen, which just requires extra care. Okay. We're then going to bandage it after so that you don't have to deal with looking at it. And we're going to watch you overnight, so nothing that we can't take care of, okay? I'm going to start first with a clinical formula. Of an iodine solution, very similar to what you'd see in some sort of surgery room, but this is just very, 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 very thorough cleansing. It is a clinical formula with iodine and a bit of squalene so that you do not scar. So I'm actually just going to directly drop that onto the area. some sort of injuries, so down here at the cheek. You appear to be getting sleepy. That's okay. reading that it was a skateboarding incident. I love skateboarding and longboarding, so I understand, but you need to wear a helmet next time, and please be aware of the things surrounding you, okay? Good. Trust me, we want you to be as safe as possible, so you can feel like you again.
How's that feeling? Like nothing at all. Great. I'm going to move on to a more vigorous cleansing solution now. I have a cleansing pad with a very astringent cleansing solution. And I'm going to also add an anti-inflammatory to it so we can reduce the swelling. Flipping with the bottle here, just going to apply a bit of that to the solution. Okay. And I'm going to gently press it on the area. If at all this hurts, let me know. But we're going to take care of this with as much care as we can. So just mixing that around. feeling much better. A little smile on your face and closed eyes is always something that lets me know that something good is going on, okay? Yeah. Sleep is also good for healing. going to write down what I did today. And before I let you doze off to sleep in this ward, I'm just going to move you around a bit, shift you around so you do not get any sores on your body. So I'm just going to push the arm a bit. Just move your arm and lift it up. Okay, now 
I'm going to just reach to your hip and lift your hip up and the other side as well. So I'm just going to lift the hip up. Okay. And to the other side now. Okay. Again, cozy there. Good. So I'll be back. Um, in a couple hours to check in on the wound, but you go to sleep now, okay? Have a good snooze, dear, and I hope you feel better soon.